Hi, everybody. It's me, Eric, again. How's everybody doing? Um, today I'm coming on to show you guys, um, my wings, um, making for this month. Um, wings, um, is an organization that Rose likes to crochet does. She does it for a great organization. I will give you more info on the bottom or you can go as to Rose likes to crochet. So every month they do something different. And this month in August, we are doing aprons. Um, we did aprons last year too. I also donated last year. This is my second year donating. I love it. It really makes me happy and excited, you know, to help somebody. So I do the half aprons. Um, you can do any aprons. You can even do sew aprons, crochet, knitting, any type of handmade, um, aprons is accepted. So I did the half ones and it's kind of nice because you don't need a whole skein to do it either because I did half one. So I did like a half skein of one multicolor whatever and then I like to use a solid color so all together I made three so I will show you guys the three that I made the first one that I made was one of these multicolor uh, I think it was a red heart super saver maybe multi with the pinks and uh, pinks and purples and then on the top for like the band and the ties I just used um, a solid pink and then on the bottom I got a purple Hopefully it matches kind of with the light purple. And I did the really cute like little edge or border. Can you guys see that? Um, I think it was like a double crochet or three or whatever. And I kind of did a really neat edge. I don't know where I saw it from. I think probably YouTube. So the first one I made was this one, like ties. Um, you can put pockets on them. I don't know if I'm putting pockets on mine yet. Um, I haven't decided, but at least I got that one done. Um, the second one I made was another multicolor skein. This one was a multi one. I think this might have been a Hirschner's yarn. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this was like a Falls Hirschner's. So I did it, used the rest. I think that's all I had too. I went right down to the nitty gritty with this one and just finished it off. And then on the bottom of this one, I just, no, you know what? I didn't even do a border on this one. This is still, oh, actually, you know what? If you look real close, I think it's like right there to right there. I was this much short on finishing it. So I just added a solid color to finish it. And then I did a solid gray for the band on the waist and a solid gray for the two ends. All right, my third one was another multicolor one. This one was, um, I think I used two, a solid in a multicolor. Yeah, I had two half skeins, I think. So I used one multicolor one and one solid color. So the multicolor is different like pinks and maroons and I think even some shades of brown in there. And then the second half was like maroon. And then I did a really cute border, if you guys can see that, hopefully. I did a really cute border on the bottom of just solid pink. And then the um, ties is pink. And the waistband is pink. So those are my three. Um, I still need to, like, probably tie my ends in. I didn't weave all my ends in yet, even my ends up here. I didn't weave all my ends in yet. I will get to that before I mail it out. But that is August. It is not too late to start that. I'm not sure when I'm going to upload this video. I'm thinking I'll probably upload it to the second week in August. So you'll still have time. She collects them till the end of the month, but only send her the items for that month. And then the next month, you send the other items. All right, you guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being a part of my channel. I love you guys. Please check Rose Like to Crochet out. Check out what she's doing. And again, thank you. Hit like, subscribe, and we will see you again next time. Bye!